Hi everybody. I know I told everybody I was going to do a live on Thursday, but I cannot. I have to work, so that kind of sucks. So, for anybody that's watched me for any amount of time, I deliberately picked out my Walmart sweatshirt. Got my hair up in my bun. So, did that out of good fun. I have some more rehabs I want to show you. Um, I'm sorry that I have to work tomorrow, so I thought I would record something for you today. I got lots of goodies. Some things you have seen, some things you haven't seen. I think it's going to be fun. So, what I want to show you first is, I don't know if you're familiar with another reseller, up and coming. Um, her name is Purse Curator. Um, check out her channel. Like and subscribe. I want to show you something awesome that I acquired from her. Beautiful, beautiful, big old Michael Kors tote. Look at this baby. Absolutely gorgeous. Huge. Absolutely huge. Gotta love it. Oh. So, I'm really proud of this. Best money that I've spent. It is massive and it is all mine. And I just wanted to show you, guess what? I'm prepared today. So if the lighting sucks, we can get in these bags and we can get some measurements. And that's a first for me. <laughs> so without further ado, let's put this back up here. I would like to start with this gorgeous Michael Kors, Michael Kors, Michael Kors, <laughs> Michael Kors clutch. It's embossed, beautiful condition. It's like a creamy white with these awesome buckles. Beautiful inside and out. There you go. One slip pocket, it says Michael Michael Kors. On this side, got an open pocket, and it has a little boo-boo there. But it's older. It's beautiful. Can't go wrong with the Michael Kors. That's going to be number one. And the Michael Kors is going to be $35. I had it listed before for $40. i am going to drop five bucks off. Hopefully, somebody will love it. Because she is absolutely gorgeous. Next up, I got from another reseller. I got it from Kristen. She's beautiful. Lovely lady. Absolutely sweet. The messenger laptop bag, canvas. I didn't have to do a whole lot to this because she is legit. You need to check her channel out too. She's a beautiful woman. Inside the back pocket. Let's see here, we have a zipper pocket inside the outer pocket. You can see down in there, it's a fuzz. Seriously, man, there you go. So I think you can see down there now because it's picking up the fuzzes. <laughs> Strap is fabric. Isn't this gorgeous? There you go. I thought you all would really appreciate my fluffiness today. You see all the fluffy, fluffy better. Okay, so you get to see it. And we'll measure this because it is actually supposed to be. It is the 70285. I don't know if you have maybe a, uh, look at that. Now you can see in there. I actually pulled out that donut ring thing on a stick, but I don't pull it out very much. I've been using just my phone because it, at some point, I bet you, you this thing will go and just kind of drop. So, you know, when, you know, on one of these um, influencer stick things, you know, when you spend 30 bucks, you get what you pay for, you know. But I didn't want to spend a whole lot of money until I get to my thousand subscribers. Get a little place there for, uh, whatever you want. <laughs> Open pocket. It's got a zipper pocket on the side. There's the creed. So, I don't know who in the right mind would call this, you know, a 
laptop thing. I think you might put your iPad or something in there, you know, uh, because my laptop wouldn't fit in there, but I got a 15 inch laptop. We got lots of pockets here in the front. Another open pocket. That zippers. And this zippers. But this is really, really nice. It needed minimal shine up. You got your little hang tag. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Messenger bag. So if you're interested in the messenger bag, I'm letting her go today for 65 that would be number two. I'm going to put everything down in the description box. So if I forget to put the numbers on there or what have you, but we'll go ahead and fight to get this back in here. But we'll get it in there. And then we'll pull out the trusty tape measure, the one that I fight with, oh, so religiously. You know, it's one of these things. I think it's for fabric, you know. I wonder how, how big my head is. I don't know. But, all right. So I'm going to give approximates. I'd say about nine. And we'll do this upside down because why not? I'm holding it. By 13. So, I mean, you know, an iPad, I wouldn't go so far as to say, and it, it, it's four inches deep. I wouldn't put them, unless you have a tiny old laptop. If I had a laptop that small, I wouldn't be able to see. I already got to have my readers on all the time because I'm just getting that kind of old. But that's just me. So 65. Another one of my rehab bags. I did fix it. Fix it up. Check them out. The suede. This was a labor of love. Beautiful condition now. Isn't she darling? Just darling. It doesn't come, it didn't come with a crossbody strap. Really nice on the inside. It has two open pockets like probably every other person in the universe. And one zipper pocket. There's the creed. It is. One, four, three, three. I'm going to say nine. I'm trying not to put it on my eyeballs. But... You could very easily put a crossbody strap on there. Isn't that neat? I don't have any solid ones left, but I do have some straps if anybody's interested. I got two left. I had one uh, left of the camo, but that got called. <laughs> So if you're interested in a strap, I do have a lot more coming. These are $15 each. Very nice, soft fabric. So those are the straps. <coughs> You've all seen this. The backpack was quite popular, but I just want to remind everybody, I still have this beautiful pale yellow Zach Posen handbag. Awesome crossbody strap. It's here in the front. Beautiful inside and out. It's got a plaque there. It says Zach Posen. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Has a little bit of wear where it's been opened and closed right there, but that can be probably polished out. This bag is amazing. I've got this up high today. I'm gonna get my arms, I'm gonna get a workout. Beautiful bag. Beautiful. Beautiful. I probably should lower you guys down just a little bit so you can see things. 
There you go. Is that better? There we go. Mr. Zach Posen. Got a little charm. A little Zach Posen charm. Beautiful. Nice crossbody. I love him. I, if you guys haven't figured it out by now, <laughs> I really like Zach Posen. The more intricate, the better, you know. So, he's pretty cool. So, I had Zach for 125 and I had a 115. I'm going to put him on today. I can't go any lower than 95. So, Zach Posen is now on sale for $95. And that's probably where he's going to stay. Next, you've seen this. I've showed this. Brand new. I've never used it. This is a big old nylon tote. Coach. Got the hang tag. Beautiful, perfect condition. Beautiful. Oh, we got some stuffing in there. Okay. So we're gonna take advantage of this light. There you go. So if you just need a for the gym or running off to the store, I put little packages in there when I go to the posty, but that's what I would use it for. But this is a black nylon coach. Nice, nice, nice. The Black Nylon Coach. Oh, I'm sorry. The Black Nylon Coach is $40. That's why I'm putting all the prices in the description box because, dang. I have a little Brighton. A little sparkly. It says exercise. I'd rather accessorize. It's got the little puppy on the back and it's sparkly, sparkly. Little charm. It's got a little glue discoloration right there, but it doesn't take away from the bag. And inside the zipper, <clears throat> inside the zipper, is the little, the cutest little crossbody strap. So it does come with the strap. Isn't that cute? Cute, cute, cute. <laughs> Excuse me. So if you're interested in the Brighton, <coughs> interested in the Brighton, he's $25. Oh, Next, excuse me, I had to pause you so I could cough. You know, cough, 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 cough. It's this gorgeous Colhan leather. Strap. Woven detail in the front. Big old pocket there in the back. It's got orange inside. It's got even tiny, tiny little full disclosure. But I could probably buff that out. She looks so pretty to me, I didn't really have to do anything to her. Little tiny mark. Maybe it might not be right where my finger is. Right there. That might come out. Orange inside. Isn't that a beautiful orange? This is a beautiful orange. Puffer stuff. Okay. Beautiful on the inside. It says Colhan. It's got a zipper pocket. And of course, it has two open sleeves on the inside. Love the orange. Beautiful Colhan bag. Lovely, lovely. I don't usually pick up too much Colhan, but you know, we do what we do. So if you're interested in the Colhan bag, she's 65. 
worth every penny. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. You will love it. I love the logo. Is there a logo? Nice. You can even put a crossbody onto this one. And you give it a whole new vibe. <laughs> I do have a bunch more coming, like I said. I've been really into changing the purses up. Give it a whole new vibe, you know, and then it just kind of renews your love in it so it doesn't sit, you know? So Kohan is 65. The next you've seen before is the Madewell Doctor Bag. Antique brass hardware. Beautiful condition. Handles. Cool, cool. And of course, he's all stuck to the gill. We have a zipper pocket and two open pockets. Go figure. Nice and clean in there. It does have. Might be the wrong bag. Nope. Just a shadow. Okay. I do have one that has like a bit of a pen mark in the bottom, but this ain't it. So. Made well tag. Gorgeous thick leather. Wonderful. So with these sides. You know, it, it doesn't have V-rings for a uh, crossbody. But this one matches well enough. You could, yeah, there you go. You pop one on there. This would give it a whole new vibe. Wouldn't it? Nice. Pretty. If you like me, well, there you go. You can get your little doctor bag. I would probably do that. It's got little feetsies on the bottom, but, you know, we all find a way to scuff these bad boys up. So. I had a feeble attempt at putting on some makeup today. But I'm just not into all the makeup, you know? Mm -hmm. Menopause will do that to you, man. You know, any kind of makeup. I break out like a teenager. But one of those things. I like my skin to breathe. I don't need to hide behind a whole bunch of that. Nice. Give it a whole new vibe. A plain old blah, blah, doctor bag. Can look really really cool but it's made well beautiful leather beautiful beautiful bag there you go mr madewell is 70 dollars today i had him for 85 or i had him for 90 then i put him to 85. i am putting him on sale today for 70 dollars Next one, you guys, I think are really going to like. Really, really going to like. If you like Patricia Nash and you like Enlarge and In Charge, she a big and I love the hardware, how the hardware is also hanging. Distressed looking leather. Beautiful condition. Comes with a dust bag. You've got, of course, you've got the two open pockets with the rooshy rooshies and zipper pocket. Let me see right on down in that bad boy. Dust bag. Big, thick leather. Beautiful. I 
actually acquired this. It's got a back pocket. Locally. From a lady that I ran into at the grocery store. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. It was a luck of the draw. It's got a pocket here in the front. It smells like her perfume. Um, I will remedy that. It doesn't smell bad, but you know, perfumes, things like that. The leather lotions. Um, and you know, the alcohol content stuff to take pen marks out and all the chemicals we use to take care of our bags I already have a real small, a real small, a real strong scent. Um, I don't want to add perfume on it. You know, no, you know, it smells nice. Don't get me wrong, but it's there. Um, so anybody that's sensitive, look at this. This doesn't sell. I won't be mad. I might, I might try to rock this baby. Yeah, I've got a house in here. Big. So, just for you know giggles, because they have them in all sizes. This one's like <laughs> nice. Yeah, this happened to be the grocery store the right day. Thirteen. Do it. Do this on my lap. I'd, I'd say 17 and a half. Yeah. And then it is a solid four deep. <laughs> so Patricia Nash, I have her set at, where did I put it? There it is. $70. And that is a deal for a tote of this size. It is Gorgeous. Hmm. Looks good. Looks real good. Hmm. Yeah, I'm loving it. The perfume smells really good too, I gotta say. She smells good. I could sniff her all day. I'd be wearing this at the store going, yeah, look at my bag, bitches. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> Love it. $70 and she is yours. Next up. Yeah, let's do this one. You guys, there was a lot of interest in this one. This was in one of the unboxings. I thought it was denim. It's made to look like denim, but it's actually canvas. Beautiful condition. Michael Kors. This was one of the unboxings. So you know they send, ATS sends one of these things. I'm just going to leave it down in there. I'm sure we all know what a Michael Kors looks like. We have a zipper pocket, two open pockets on the other side. You see, I saw that seat on in there. This is one I got from ADS. It says Michael Michael Kors. There you go. Isn't this beautiful? So we got the two open pockets. This side has a big old zipper pocket. Oh, here. <laughs> big old zipper pocket. And then in front of it, it's got two more open pockets. And there's lots and lots of room. Pristine condition. No signs of wear. I don't know if anybody's ever, ever even wore this. I mean, literally. There's not even any creasing where the holes are. So, but it is adjustable a little bit. Beautiful Michael Kors. 60 bucks. Before I forget to tell you. Get the Michael Kors. I am really excited about one that's coming up. So, <clears throat> this one I got from another reseller whom we all love. Um, I tried to use it. I tried to love it. Not feeling it. Mm. 
So, I'm going to sell it for what I pay for it. And I want to make sure I got the right one because I don't have my glasses on yet. This is a Kipling bag. Genuine leather. Got it from a reseller we all love. Kipling. It's even got the little monkey. Kipling. I tried to love it. I tried to use it. But I ended up like overstuffing it. So, it's got a few marks. Um... I don't know if you really can't see them on camera, but I will, uh, I did buy some stuff, that magic stuff that he uses, and I will go over it again. Um, I didn't abuse it or anything. The leather is buttery soft. I see a lot of the Kipling bags. Um, they're not leather, and then some of them are faux, are faux leather. This is not. This is leather. It's got two pockets in the front. You know, you open up, stick things in there. So if I keep stepping out of shot, I'm sorry. But I'm not used to standing up. I'll get used to that. And let me know in the comments um, if you like it better this way so I can put things on. I don't want individuals to think that I'm copying them or I want to be them when I grow up. So, there you go. This has got all kinds of stuff in it comes with a little Kipling coin purse. Isn't that cute? Cute, cute, cute. Beautiful purple on the inside. So, let's see here. It's got, then it's got a pocket here. It's got a little, it's got a lid on it. So that one's not an open pocket, but it's got a regular pocket. It's got a place for your pens. Open pocket there. pocket Kipling. so it's really nice it feels like it's padded but it's behind the the um, front pockets Ooh, we have a tag here I was trying not to have to do this but you know how it is you know, I gotta look like a, like I'm smart. <laughs> All righty, says Kipling leather. Ta. So so I thought this was unique. It was pretty popular, you know. I had to be quick to get it. When I got it, I thought I thought it would be a little bigger. But hey, you know, it's another cool bag. It is cool. So it's been in storage for quite a while. Some of you might remember it. So if you want it, I paid 70 bucks for it. So it needs a home. There's a lot of Kipling lovers out there. $70. Is what I paid. I'm not looking to make any money on it. You know, we all know I'm trying to purge so that we can get into my new house. So, if you love it, get her. Because you don't see a whole lot of genuine leather ones. I was really hard pressed in defining when I found a lot of faux leather. I found, you know. 70 bucks, and the Mr. Monkey Man could be yours. <laughs> Did I actually ever show you guys my laptop bag? This is a mulberry. I'm getting Starbucks notifications. Man, I really like a Starbucks. I really like it. Isn't she a beaut? This is what I carry my, my laptop in. Beautiful. I don't know if you can see it. Light might be. Buckle detail. Now this fits my laptop. 
That is so pretty. I'm lined. Got my receipts in there. <laughs> Beautiful. So yeah, that's my laptop bag. Little side note. Mm. <laughs> Beautiful mulberry, absolutely authentic. But I love her so much. Next is a good one. Whatever they all are. My Dooney girls, Dooney Dooney girls. This leather will scratch, this leather will patina. Doesn't matter how much you condition it or what you do, it's gonna do it. This is a Florentine. With the heart details. You breathe on it, it's gonna scratch. But it looks cool. I really kind of like that about that. You know how the Florentine leather is. That's the bottom. Isn't she a beauty? I used it for a little bit. I always got it with the intention of selling it, so I quit carrying it because. You know, I don't want to scratch it up. People, you know, don't want it all scratched up when they get it. But the Florentine leather, look how thick that is, man. I'm telling you. Thick. Beautiful Florentine tassels. <laughs> this one I acquired, again, locally. My little old lady actually asked me how she wanted to sell some things. And I looked at some of her things. And that's where I got some of my bitches. Vintage. My vintage. My vintage totes. And I got this. And I went back and forth about it. went back and forth about it. and One of those things. So, inside. Gorgeous. You have... Big old open pocket. You have your key. Right here is, I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> your little Dooney tag. There. there you go. Two open pockets on the other side. And then a big old zipper pocket right in the middle. And then it also comes with the registration still got the tags in there $348 so I left all that in there because I briefly carried it she never carried it so absolutely pristine isn't she gorgeous well the Dooney maybe it's a him I'm not sure so one of the buckles has a little bit, little bitty, full disclosure, a little bit of tarnish right there. It'll tarnish right out, I'm fairly certain. But I do have some Brasso. I don't know, would that work on there? You all think Brasso? I don't know. I bought some. I got it on, uh, on uh, what is that at? Amazon. But I haven't been able to bring myself to actually use it on <laughs> One of my handbags. I don't get too adventurous with it. So, the three hundred dollar bag. I'm gonna let it go for one hundred fifteen. So take full advantage of that with all the details. That's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bag. <coughs> You've seen this one before. Beautiful, Hobo International tote. Teal color. I love how it's the vegetable tan. It's nice. Big old long strap drop. So the hobo. Let's try it last. Okay. It's an 11 strap drop. Nice pretty flowers on the inside. So this is 13. 
leg thing again. By 13. So it's a square. <laughs> it's got really cool. Like I said, it's got the back pocket in the back. It was really cool. Zip pop to zip pop closure. Yeah, this thing. Got lots of stuff in there. <sighs> and we're back. Okay. There you go. That is good. <sighs> Zipper pocket. Here we go. Underneath there's two open pockets. If you, there we go. Lots of flowers. Hobo Creed, if I can. It doesn't want to come out and say hi, but there it is. Then it has another open pocket and a big open pocket. So this here, again, could be for your iPad or whatever. This pocket here, not really a pocket, but it's padded. So you can pop your little iPad right down in there and it'll be protected. It's all padded. I didn't catch that before. Mm -hmm. This is beautiful. It's still on sale for $50. Can't go wrong there. Nice. Nice. And that is all yours. This one you haven't seen in a while. I haven't pulled out. I'm going to get in trouble by Hana. Lee B. Skint. Lee B. Kent. Lee B. Skint. So this is an L bag. <laughs> the cube. I call it the cube. I don't know if that's what it actually is. Is it feetsies? It's in a really cool, like... Minty, gray, gray base, minty. Yeah, like a greenish, grayish. Neat little bag. There you go. So, and we'll measure it up. Look at the handles. Cool. Front pocket. I like the fabric inside. It's pretty neat too. So it has these little rings here. If you wanted to put a crossbody on it, you easily could. Let's do the back one. It says Berlin. Maybe maybe skin. Libby's skint. Oh, speaking of crossbodies, I done forgot. It comes with a crossbody. So there you go. It comes with a crossbody. In the inside, there you go. What comes with a crossbody? I'm over here. Yeah, you can put your own crossbody on there. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Inside the bag. Putting all my stuffing and stuff out on the person, you can't see the person. Because you know, hey man, you know. I am who I am. <laughs> there we go. Next, last but not least, my last bag that I just moved out of. Which I know myself probably won't again. My beloved Isabella bag. Isn't she pretty? I bought her brand new. Paid full price. Paid a lot for her. Used her for a month or two. Back zipper pocket. Two side pockets. Yeah. Yeah. 
stuffing in there. No ink pen went into this bag. I don't know if you are in any. Big, heavy. She's heavy. I'm not going to lie. There is some weight to her. Brass hardware. Big, thick leather. Lover. Probably going to get seller's remorse. It's got a zipper pocket. It's got an open pocket over here. Beautiful. So, there was no abuse. No zipper, no uh, pins going in there. None of that stuff. Usually with the heavier bags, you see that? I just smack them all in our balls. Beautiful. You can remove the crossbody if you want to, but she's pretty weighty. I don't know why you would want to, because once you put stuff in there, do you really want to carry a big old handbag? Nah. We want to put that stuff around our neck and run off. Yes. She's gorgeous. You know, I'm gonna take a big loss, but that's okay. I'm hoping somebody will love her. Details, look at the details, so pretty. Brand new condition, of course. She's only, she's only a couple months old. She's only like seven or eight months old. She's not, yeah. She's not old. So the Isabella bag is 150. I paid that for her. So not looking to make any money on her either. Um, she just needs a really good home with somebody that's gonna love her. So I wanted to show you. I showed you some of the project bags that I have been working on. Um, the ones that I'm getting done. I'm still working on that crossbody. I got a square that's giving me serious fits. I don't know how else to clean it. It's just driving me insane. And I think I'm probably about over it. So, I'm going to grab it for you. If you're interested. Because I got one square. That can't get clean. Yeah. So, let me show it to you. Everything else is cleaned up. Except for the other member of this. She needed cleaned it up, found out, so it's got a it's got a boo boo be doo. All uh, clean. Now, you guys are probably gonna think I'm crazy, but right there, that square, that square, might not be a big deal to you, but it's not up to my standards, so. This was the last project bag. All the other suede, everything else come up real clean. Good grief, it's gorgeous. It these. So <laughs> if you're interested, I will let it go for 45 bucks. Beautiful. I don't understand. Maybe, I'm not, I've never really been real good with suede. That's why I don't ever buy it. So, I have a lot of money wrapped up in suede cleaning stuff. I tried the eraser thing. I tried the spray stuff from Kiwi. I tried, you name it, I tried it. Don't work for me, man. So, <laughs> up to you guys. Oh, FedEx guys, so my dogs are going to go absolutely ape. Uh, language. They're gonna go bananas. There's the inside. It's got two open pockets. One zipper pocket. Oh, did you want to see a zipper pocket? <laughs> there you go. And the creed. Duh. So, uh, 
five. Yeah. It's not even, we're not even going to do 45. If you guys are interested in my project bag, which I, you might think is fine. Um, uh, I don't. This can be made into a crossbody as well, but it's one of those things where you gotta do a little surgery. You gotta take this off of here, you gotta move this up. Anyway, too much work, man. So I just left it, leave it in it. It's a nice bag, it's just, I couldn't get it all cleaned up. Everything else though, cleaned up real nice. So I mean, if you're looking for a bag, you can tootle around in, take to work, you know. Um, that you're not real worried about but you want to carry a coach then this is one for you maybe a gift for a teenager that wants to touch your stuff I have granddaughters that are always wanting to touch my bangs and touch everything they want to eat popsicles and they want to eat with their fingers and do these things and what's going on here yeah make sure you guys tell me if I look like a total ding dong um, this would be probably the bag I would reach for or, you know, one of the other project bags. So I would say 80% success. I'm not going to give it a hundred percent because this is making me absolutely crazy. So it needs a new home, 40 bucks and you can have a badger bag. I didn't even... I got so discouraged I didn't even polish the hardware yet. I love this. Too bad this doesn't come off because I would so be, you know, I'd be donating this and I'd be keeping this because dang, I mean, wow. It's like big, thick, luscious, luscious. So, there you go. Project fix. So I tried to get her clean. I'm still just over the moon. Over my tote I got from Purse Curator. Mm. Matthew. I even like the. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Grief. All the lovely things I'm going to be able to put in here. It does come with a crossbody strap too. Because this baby, this is not a Michael Michael Kors. This is an actual Michael Michael Kors collection piece. So, worth every penny, man. Like I don't have enough totes, but you know, the girl sees what she's got to have. You know, and you got to have. It's one of those. So, I also have a little surprise for everybody. I, like I said, I couldn't go live for tomorrow. Sorry, I keep stepping on from. Uh, couldn't go live for tomorrow, and I apologize. So, I'm hoping that this recording um, reaches a lot well. Um, I am going to, as a surprise, drop goodies into. The first couple of people who make comments, um, I'm going to do a random, I'm going to pick comments at random, and I'm going to drop goodies. Um, you want to see what I'm going to do? All right. So, found a few beautiful things. Anybody that wears costume jewelry, I do not because I'm allergic to nickel. I'm allergic to all things really pretty. <laughs> so, Jessica McClintock. I'm assuming that is a costume, whatever. But, there you go. Hey, can you see the reflection of that donut thing? Yeah. You know, I had to do some things because the cord on this thing is only like that long. So I got my laptop <laughs> extension cord so I can plug it in. It's ridiculous. But this is going to appear 
in somebody's bag. And anybody that buys my beautiful Isabella and wants to love her, I'll put something special down in there too. But this is going to go to a random comment. And they have to be nice comments. I don't want to hear about how I look Walmart. I don't want to hear any, any of that crap. Keep it nice. You don't have to keep it G-rated, but keep it nice. There you go. So thank you all for coming. Um, please like and subscribe. If you like my standing and showing you these things, let me know. Because usually I've just been sitting because I was kind of stuck because I fight with this thing, but I think i got to figure it out. Um, talk to me. Stay crazy. Love you all.